Your Excellency, Prime Minister Orban Viktor of Hungary, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. I wish a very warm welcome to Prime Minister Orban, to Mrs. Levi Aniko and their delegation. I last met the Prime Minister in 2014 in Milan at the Asia-Europe meeting, and I'm very happy to see him again. We have a chance to discuss ways to strengthen our growing bilateral relations and to bring our two regions closer together. Hungary, particularly through its world-class talents in scientific research and technology, has contributed to Singapore's development. Sir George Rada, a renowned Hungarian scientist of Hungarian descent, was previously the chairman of ASTAR's Biomedical Research Council. He also established the Singapore Bioimaging Consortium and the Clinical Imaging Research Centre in Singapore, which contributed significantly to our R&D development. His work continues to inspire students and researchers in Singapore to look for solutions to improve the lives of the people. I, too, have deep impressions of Hungary's top academic talents and institutions. When I was in Cambridge, my mathematics supervisor was Professor Bella Bolabash, whom you probably know is a Hungarian. And I received an honorary doctorate from the Utvosh Loran University when I visited Budapest in 2007, which was the alma mater of Professor Bolabash and also of Prime Minister Orban. I'm therefore very pleased to see the ongoing collaborations between our research centers and institutes of higher learning. ASTAR has been working closely with Vichem Kemi Research to develop drugs for cancer treatment. Local universities in Singapore, NUS, NTU, and SMU, also have frequent exchanges with Hungarian universities. And I hope that the Memorandum of Understanding on Education Cooperation between the Singapore Ministry of Education and the Hungarian Ministry of Human Capacities, EMMI, will promote further talent development and education exchanges between our two countries. I would like particularly to thank Hungary for the scholarships which it is giving, offering to Singapore students. They will open up many new opportunities for Singapore students to study in Hungary and learn from your expertise and your experiences. These exchanges will foster greater people-to-people -people linkages, especially among our youths. I'm also glad that our collaboration extends to sports, which is a conducive activity to bring people and communities together. Hungary is a major sports nation, and I understand that the Prime Minister was a professional once, as an avid sports fan and a former athlete. Several Singapore sports institutions, including the Singapore Sports School, have visited Hungary to learn from your sporting excellence. I'm particularly happy to see that the Prime Minister has brought along a sizable business delegation. It signals Hungary's strong economic interest in the region. I hope both sides will have fruitful discussions at the Business Forum tomorrow morning. Singapore and Hungary are natural partners for bringing our two regions together. We are both gateways, one to Central and Eastern Europe, one to Southeast Asia, Hungary is an important emerging market in Europe and a major trade and manufacturing centre for Central and Eastern Europe. Singapore is a trading and financial hub for ASEAN and beyond. Hungary is Singapore's largest Visegrad 4 trading partner. Likewise, Singapore is Hungary's largest ASEAN trading partner. I look forward to the ratification of the EU-Singapore Free Trade Agreement, for this will also give a further boost to Singapore-Hungary relationships. Prime Minister, I thank you for visiting Singapore, and I wish you and your delegation a productive time here. I'm confident your visit will spur greater cooperation and exchanges between our two countries and peoples and our two regions. Prime Minister, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, may I now invite you to join me in a toast to the good health and success of Prime Minister Orban, Mrs. Levi, and the delegation and the enduring and close friendship between Hungary and Singapore. Cheers.